Oatmeal has been used for centuries as a topical soothing agent on the skin to relieve itch and irritation in dermatology. Of course, this is coming from Johnson & Johnson that sells a brand of oatmeal lotion. But look, if it helps with dry skin or a bug bite, I can imagine having some soothing quality. But this study shocked me. There's a class of chemo drugs like cetuximab that causes an awful rash. I mean, it's bad enough you have some horrible cancer, but then to have some painful, itchy rash on top of it. Various treatments have been tried and failed. There's no clear preventive or curative treatment for this eruption. Or is there? The researchers had heard about this study, in which uh, human skin fragments from plastic surgery were subjected to an inflammatory chemical, and adding an oatmeal extract appeared to help. So, hey, what do you have to lose? Of the 10 patients with chemo rashes they were able to get access to to try some oatmeal lotion, six had a complete response, and four a partial response, giving an overall oatmeal response rate of 100%. Doctors wrote in from around the world. Significant improvement in all patients uh, seemed rather too good to be true, but out of desperation they tried it and got the same astonishing results. Oatmeal, a simple topical agent producing such spectacular benefit uh, where more complex therapies have failed. You know, in an age when ever more expensive treatments are consistently being championed, it would be a great pity if this inexpensive, natural approach to relieving distressing symptoms were to be overlooked. Ironically, two of the cancer cell lines found resistant in vitro to this kind of chemotherapy were found to be sensitive to avenanthamides, which are unique phytonutrients found in oats, suggesting that people should apply oatmeal to their insides as well.